If you've been on the internet long enough, you would know about the dark side of the internet when it comes to YouTube. With countless hours of disturbing content on YouTube and bizarre rabbit holes that often blur the line between a shock site and YouTube, one of the more disturbing, if not disgusting, rabbit holes on YouTube is called Elsa Gate. A well-known rabbit hole with seemingly family-friendly content but with inappropriate themes that trick children into thinking that they're going to watch an 8-hour My Little Pony retrospective, but instead, they're met with dumb to Cosita attempting to molest a nine-year-old Minecraft boy. This is not only the tip of the iceberg for Elsa Gate content, but also the tip of the iceberg for rabbit holes. Meaning that this kind of shit is actually considered tame when compared to other rabbit holes. Unfortunately, I have dipped into the deeper parts of rabbit holes. So stuff like this makes me feel numb. A specific content creator that is involved with Elsa Gate that we'll be talking about is Futuristic Hub, a man who has contributed to my childhood trauma by uploading Minecraft porn on YouTube. I will never forget this YouTube terror I got from watching that video as a child. Enough talking about being traumatized by his content as a kid, it's time to be traumatized even more by going into detail about how he misleads viewers in his content. His content, if you can call it that, is the equivalent of stubbing your toe, but instead of stubbing your toe, your body gets mutilated, or at least that's how I feel when I view his content. Futuristic Hub is unique, unique in the worst way possible. In a concerning number of ways, he can be much worse than a lot of other Elsa Gate content creators. The most overt fetish insertion in his content and thumbnails, as well as the constant sex baiting or straight up porn in many of his videos. These videos are painfully misleading, they are constantly marketed as if they are aimed at children, but then you have videos like Dame to Cosita attempting to molest a nine-year-old Minecraft kid. Oh, show me your little thingy, that's what Dame Cosita means. And this fat man meme talking about how he likes feet. I'm the glob glow gab -gala. I like feet because I don't have any. And this basement is a true treasure trove. And not only that, there are there are, there are a ton of rape jokes being sprinkled around. The fact that it's a rape joke isn't the only issue here, because these videos are clearly aimed at children. They will be exposed to these types of words, which will only serve as a gateway to even more horrifying things. The date meme video is a typical animation video with a strange and uncomfortable vibe, with that being the punchline most of the time, as with most content creators who do similar types of animations. I would be fine with this if it weren't for the fact that this channel is marketed towards children, and the fact that it's obviously a feet fetish video. This video will expose children to fetishes such as the one shown in the video. I'm pretty sure a lot has been affected and I'm also pretty sure a child has gone up to their parents and said they liked feet and have been interrogated for that. There's also a reddit post talking about their 6 year old sister as the poster about rape. Thanks to futuristic help, now children know about words that they shouldn't know about and he has single handedly scarred multiple children because of his videos and his clickbait which harm children with their content by being a gateway to more horrible things on the internet. For Unfortunately, I can now stop talking about Futuristic Hub. Now that we are at an end, you are now obligated to subscribe to me and only me and not the other individuals in the video because I am the next Paris Cynical. Soon I will become British and consume furry arts to get into the Paris Cynical mindset. It's time to pass this off to Adriel or his innocence. <laughs>